going on, guys? Well, that was smooth. Yeah. We usually decide who's going to talk. We just did it right now again. Um, so we're going to talk about our pickups today. And what percentage we're at and how far we are and, and uh, is collecting. Difficulties of where we're at. It's getting more difficult mm -hmm. on my yeah, end. Especially on Danny's end because he's at, uh, what, what percentage are you at? I'm days? actually almost at 71%. Uh, but games, I have 486. That's uh, that's uh, going to be a tough, basically uphill battle. Yeah, there's a lot. A... The, even though it's 200 games, it's you guys be surprised how hard those 200 games are. That's to find. the thing. Like I've said throughout all these videos, I'm all about the volume. I want to just get my most bang for my buck. So obviously, you're going to knock off the the five to ten dollar range. But now it's getting ridiculously difficult because everybody knows what the value of the game is. Everybody's trying to make a buck. And I understand it, you know, on the retail end, you have your overheads and stuff like that. But as a collector, you want to get it for the cheapest price. You want to try to save money to complete the collection. Uh, but it's really getting difficult. So basically, my hands are empty because I don't have any pickups. But Mike ended up picking up a whole bunch of stuff, which is a nice, decent stack, which kind of motivated me to get my ass in gear. So... But. So this is this is my stack for basically the month. We have a video of where I got this from. Um, I am so excited about that video, but uh, this is just a little teaser of what it is. Um, yeah, like it's it's an uphill battle for both of us. More him than me because I still have a hundred and something uh, games to go. But uh, with his two hundred, it's you know everybody's collecting NES. Yeah, there are a lot of people collecting Dreamcast, and they're you know getting into my friggin' zone right now, mm -hmm. but uh, with NES, like anybody that's in this age demographic between the both of us is collecting games right now, and we wish that they'd piss off, but yeah. no, I'm joking. But like, um, you know, it's it's hard, and NES is a very sought after system, like you guys know. Uh, Dreamcast is uh, getting up there, uh, Turbo Graphics is getting up there. So there's a lot of systems that are, you know, a lot of people are looking for and keeping their eyes out for. So uh, collectors that, you know, like both of us that are gonna keep it for our collections, are you know getting this you know the shit end of the stick because yeah. those guys that are buying the games in lots yeah they're just buying it for you know the market value they just want to sell it right away and you know make the you know 30 bucks off one game so yeah exactly we're, we're trying to stay you know it, true to it it's it's uh i guess it would be like bittersweet because you know what like since we've done the youtube channel we've got a whole bunch of people that started collecting too like people in our within our family mm -hmm. and also people that that were watching our youtube channel would be like oh i remember this game and then they started collecting so it's good for them and sometimes they look out for us and they find us stuff that we need but the reality is it's, it's a competitive thing right yeah. you're you want nes this other person wants nes you want the same game it comes down to dollars you know so like I said, it's bittersweet. Like you, you want people to get involved in the community, but also you're kind of like you son of a bitch. I yeah, that real. game too. You undercut me or whatever. Yeah, but. exactly. So I, I don't know. It's it, but it's getting really, really difficult. And it's I found myself after Mike picked up this haul. Like he said, we have a video of where that all came from. I was kind of looking through a stack of over like maybe 200 games, and I couldn't find anything I needed. I, I've gotten to the point that I almost have all the games that I need in my head. So when I rip through these stacks, it's like so disappointing when you can't find something. But it's just getting difficult. The games are not all necessarily expensive, but it's like rare. They're really hard to find. You don't find them out in the wild. You have to go online. And, and the other thing is too, once I get into those higher values, it's it's hard to trust when you're buying like a game for a hundred bucks or two hundred bucks online and stuff like that. Like I don't ever want to chance that. I'd rather buy it knowing that it works knowing this knowing that because online like yeah they might there's always the ebay is going to take care of you they're not going to in the end they're they'll reimburse you or paypal will reimburse you but it's just the headache of going through that so i think towards the end when i start getting those higher titles out of the way it's going to be through a store or a reputable source that we know but yeah. it's still it's expensive it's there's a lot crazy. of sharks out there there's a lot of sharks with labels like danny did in one of our videos he was simply just replaced the label and yeah. for me i don't notice this stuff i look at it and it looks legit to me yeah. so you don't want to take that gamble on you know a hundred dollar two hundred dollar game and you're looking at it it's like oh it looks legit yeah. and then the only way to find out is open up a chip set and look at yeah, it inside exactly who's got time for that when you're getting stuff in the mail or whatever so it's you got to basically pull claims in and whatever you yeah. guys know you guys are all collectors so you know, we thank you all for the, those that actually contacted us and for, you know, uh, deals on games and stuff like that. When somebody yeah. th contacts me for Danny's games, yeah. I email them or I message them right away. Hey, exactly. if you're interested in this game, so-and-so has it. If you're interested, go take a look at it. And 
we thank you all for you know keeping a heads up and thinking about us in that so yeah for sure you know what we're gonna um i don't know how we would do this but i always thought about that um about wh what our, our remaining games are somewhere posting it somewhere I don't know if you can post it at the bottom of this description. video. Description. This is going to be a long ass description. <laughs> yeah, shit, so go. I don't know. Like maybe we'll put it on our maybe on the, on the page. I'll do uh, one for Danny. Yeah. And then I'll do one for myself, and we'll do it that way. Or we'll do maybe the top ten sought after games. Yeah. Not necessarily the most expensive, but yeah. just games that you know. Or might be in your collection. Uh, you know, was it RBI baseball? Oh, no, not RBI. No, it's the base is loaded base four. Base loaded four. So that I keep on busting his balls. I know. The game. <laughs> That's the thing. You know what? It's funny because I look through my list and it's always the third installment or the fourth installment yeah. of a game, like Adventure Island three. I need it. I have the other two. I need uh, Robocop three. I've seen these out in the wild, but it's like, am I willing to pay? So it seems like all the like the last generation of that series is always the most expensive, and we always do joke around yeah. bases loaded for, uh, because it's something that's just eluded me every time. Like I could find. Listen, bottom line is we could probably com complete our collections if we went on eBay just and on bought eBay. them all. Yeah, but that's not the fun part. That's number not. one, and it's also I, I can't trust that. I I know eBay's like. Like they're they're never gonna screw you in the end, or PayPal's not gonna PayPal's screw you. Gonna, yeah, but it's I I, I can't t bring myself to spending like two hundred dollars or a yeah. hundred bucks online for one game. I would rather see it, know it, uh, like go to a retail store. Mm -hmm. I don't mind. I don't care if the price is right. I'll do it. There's a lot of people that have collected, like uh, you know Jay Jay Bartlett from the NES Club. The whole fun is actually going out yeah. and seeing these things, and you know, you know, haggling with somebody, not necessarily busting their balls, but yeah. talking to them, and you know, see that they're interested in your collection, you're interested in theirs, and yeah. talking back and forth. And where I got this from, this was, you know, somebody reached out to me, and I, from early on in our episodes, and I was amazed that he actually kept me in mind during this time. Yeah. Uh, it, it was, it was great. Like I said, this is 21 games. Uh, all games that I need for my collection. Yeah. Not nothing's a double. I, I I could have got doubles from from the collection that he had. I didn't want that. I want just stuff that I need because I'm not planning on flipping any of this stuff. I could have got doubles just to flip. I'm not doing that. I just want my collection. That's it. You know what? It's funny though because as you were talking about that, I was thinking in my head. I was like, because of the YouTube channel, I think that we've benefited a lot of helping our collection. You know, like within the community because yeah. I think you did a lot more pickups through the youtube and the facebook everybody kind of reaching out to yeah. us and vice versa too if we come across something we tell people like hey we got this we're not necessarily collecting for the system and we kind of go back and forth but that's what community is yeah but i really think about that i think majority of the stuff that you picked up is basically it's through community. community yeah, yeah. like it's you, I, for dreamcast like nes is it's a little bit more easier to find maybe not the games that you're looking for but nes is more of a you can go into any store and there's always nes yeah dreamcast you can't find in the wild you can find dreamcast in the uh, sorry NES in the wild. You can't find much Dreamcast. You can't go to a garage sale and expect to find Dreamcast. Yeah. It's very, very hard to find. NES there are, but a lot of people would buy it just to flip. Or they look it up more. I yeah. think that a lot of people when they see an NES card, they're like, oh, this is old, this is retro. Yeah. I gotta look up what the price is. Whereas these the CD based games, they, they might not necessarily look it up. They put it in music in their music uh, collection. Exactly. Or and you know what? I was just thinking about something else. So basically, because they reached out to you, there's more love for Mike than there is for me. Thanks, Unbelievable. <laughs> what is going on here? Nobody wants to contact me. I need a, uh, a stadium event if anybody has got it. I'll pay top dollar, I promise. We're, uh, like I said, if you guys want to reach me, I, I, uh, I'm I on the, uh, the page regularly. If you guys want to reach me for Danny's collection, feel free. If you want to reach Danny, you know, there's uh, his Facebook page. Uh, is, uh, you can reach on him at any point in time. Yeah, and I have doubles too. I have NES doubles. Sometimes I buy lots and stuff like that to kind of just bundle everything together. So I have some double stuff too. So if you're collecting NES. Double stuff. Double stuff. <laughs> double stuff. What are we talking about here? It's dirty. Um, so I have a whole bunch of doubles. Uh, so if you want to know the list of doubles that I have, I also have uh, the little Samson and uh, Flintstones that are XRP. Yeah, if that's you want, a, if you want that's that. a double if you want. They're, they're repros. Oh, you. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're repros. Sorry, you're gonna put it in. It's gonna start playing Super yes, Mario. Yeah, Super Mario Silent Service. Silent Service. That's it, eh? But those are also available too. Yes. Um, but uh, seriously. Thank you for everybody that's helped us through our collecting. Mm -hmm. Thank you for awesome. the 381 or 82 subscribers, subscribers that we awesome. have. We're so close to 400. We started this almost a year ago to the date. Uh, and we're, we're amazed that people are actually sticking by us and yeah. sticking with us. 
through this collection. You know, we don't post regularly or as often as we would like. Yeah. But uh, we appreciate the people that have stayed from the very beginning and you know have commented on the regular basis on our videos. Yeah. And liked on our videos, and there's always that one fucker that dislikes. <laughs> there's always a big thumbs down. <laughs> always that one. Gotta be red thumbs too. down. Uh, yeah, I was just gonna say that. I think no matter what, like even when we had even 10 subscribers to now and to the future, we read all the comments. Yeah. And honestly, it's one of the things that I get most excited about when people comment below and talk about something that we talked about in the video. It kind of just starts a snowball effect of like back and forth uh, talking on uh, the YouTube, the comments and stuff like that. But I, I honestly look forward to that. So mm -hmm. don't be afraid to comment. Yeah. We're, we're going to respond we're, to anything. So yeah. even if we're at... Uh, 380 to 3,000 subscribers. <laughs> we're still, yeah, that's probably <laughs> You'll see more gray hairs in the yeah, beard. But, you know, we, we appreciate that. Like, we love that, uh, those yeah. comments, man. Like, it's honestly, good. it's, 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 even on Facebook, uh, the comments that, we post on on a page or whatever. We love the the, the comments that the, the rebuttals right back. Even yeah. if we make a mistake, we appreciate that yeah. the fact that you guys are reaching out to us and you know correcting us. It's 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 great. We no, love no, it. it's good. We're I, in it for the long haul. Exactly. That's the thing. I think it will never stop doing that. No. Like I said, no matter how many subscribers or wherever this takes us. Yeah, we're I not stopping. We're gonna... And once we're done, like once I'm done my Dreamcast before Danny, uh, <laughs> we're not gonna stop. <laughs> we're not gonna stop. We're not gonna stop collecting. Let's <laughs> do something else. We'll think of something else to do. Start collecting something else. Something else. Yeah. So. I appreciate everything. Yeah. We appreciate everything. Yeah, yeah we Florals, do. yeah. So um, just like, comment. comment for sure, yeah. and subscribe. Send yeah. people this. Uh, share. Share. That's it. Sharing is caring. Plus. Google <laughs> Plus is not very good, but you know what? It does its job whenever need be. That's it. All right, guys. Have Thanks. a good day. Thanks a lot, guys. Peace.